Well, if you buy your milk from the grocery store and you get one of these things, these boys, these bad boys, then yes, absolutely, your milk is estrogenic. So get this. There's actually three different kinds of estrogens in this one carton of milk. So first, the cows which make this milk are fed with soy and grain because it doesn't say grass fed. So that means it's being fed with soy, which of course, you know, has phytoestrogens, which have estrogenic effects. Then it's also fed with grain and usually the lowest quality moldy ass grain. And this contains fungus and fungus produces a toxin called ZEA, which is an estrogenic. So phytoestrogens plus ZEA, already two. Then it's in this kind of compressible plastic, which means that it contains BPA. And if it's BPA free, which doesn't even say BPA free, so it probably just has straight up BPA. And if it said BPA free, I would think that it has BPS or BPF. So three different kinds of estrogens just in this carton of milk. So what's the truth then? What should, what should you do? Well, the truth is both more terrible and more hopeful because if you just go down the aisle and you pick up one of these this is some high quality milk in a glass bottle so this is the one which I would choose and I do choose because it's in a glass bottle so it doesn't have the uh, BPA and I know it's grass fed grass finished high quality milk so I'm happy to drink it every day and the thing is I um, actually have an eggnog recipe which calls for milk. I have the esoteric eggnog elixir and you should absolutely check it out because it's a combination of egg and milk and cream, high in fat, perfect for boosting testosterone and counteracting some of the effect of this estrogenic stuff in our diet. Another thing I should say is um, if you drink skim milk, what are you doing bro? Like you shouldn't be drinking skim milk. Skim milk is a scam. 2% milk is a scam, 1% milk is a scam. They literally take out the best, most nutritious part of the milk and substitute it with fillers and they sell it for the same price. It's like, why do you drink that? If you're gonna buy milk, buy whole milk, buy it in a glass bottle if possible, grass-fed, grass-finished, and you should be good.